cheated on that. I use pressure. You use pressure. I cheated, yeah. When is it? When is pressure cheating, and when is it not cheating? My tongue position needed to be better, more forward, and on the on the top of my bottom lip, and arched, and I didn't do that. And top lip rolled in, and I didn't do that. I squeezed. Love that. Yeah, that's a really direct answer. Pressure is cheating when it's cheating, when it's compensating for right. mechanics not operating the way that you know that they could. But that said, pressure is, it's part of playing high. And even if we roll in our lips and get our tongue and everything right, there may be a change in mouthpiece pressure. Right. So don't, don't assume that just because you feel a little bit of pressure. But if you feel a little pressure and you're like, you know what, I didn't need that. I could have arched my tongue or done my lips more or whatever. When I get it clear, my tongue's up on the roof of my mouth. Uh-huh. And touching my teeth. Yep. That one was clear. And the mouthpiece pressure is less. And I can tell if, uh, if I'm not rolled in enough, that's when I get the crackle in the sound. Oh, interesting. And when I when I roll in and out, then it's clear. It just a little bit. Great. So now it's just a question of getting that coordination and then trusting the coordination in the music.